you once asked me when I knew I loved you. And I know it's not like it was love at first sight, because if it was, I probably would have stayed in science. <laughs> I think everything's happens for a reason, and for whatever the reason, messaging you in January 22, our worlds totally fell into place. From day one, all I knew, there was nothing that I'd rather do than spend time with you. I think those early days of close calls and fate-like circumstances made me know that you were the one. You are my soulmate, my best friend, and the person who inspires me to do better, the love of my life. I love how goofy you can be, waking up to you every morning, and even your bouts of stress. <laughs> <laughs> you are selfless almost to a fault, and try to put everyone ahead of yourself. You work so hard for us and yourself, and I'm so proud to tell people about you. I'm your biggest fan, and want to show and give you the world because you truly deserve it. Andrew, there's a reason why we connected all those years ago in Guelph in first year. I believe that fate brought us together because we were meant to be. The stars finally aligned and here we are, married. All I've ever wanted in life is to love and be loved. And you show your love to me in so many ways and you accept mine. Andrew, you're the love of my life. Being with you has opened up a world of love, fun and laughter that I never knew existed. I have become a better version of myself because of you. And I know I will continue to grow with you by my side. There's a French saying that I won't try to say in French, but translated, it means those who resemble, assemble. And that couldn't be truer than for both of you. And not just because you're both very attractive, but because you both have good hearts, good energies, and everyone around you enjoys your company. You bring out the absolute best in each other, and I love you guys. All right, let's get down to business. We are all here to support this commitment of love to share the joy of Aunt Ola and Andrew as they choose to spend their lives together. Thank you to the parents of the bride and groom for your presence here today. Your love and unwavering support throughout the years have given them confidence and tools necessary to enter into this new chapter together. Ola and Andrew, your marriage will be a lifelong promise to love, respect, trust, and honor each other through the good, the bad, and the unexpected. This union represents your commitment to support one another as individual beings, but also share your joys, sorrows, and dreams as one. A strong bond works in unison, not only to nurture the best parts of your personalities, but to understand each other's differences and flaws. You are committing to learn how to grow alongside one another, while remembering to keep an open mind throughout your journey. Today, you gain an equal partner that will be your confidant, your defender, and your motivator through all your aspirations and goals. The time has come, it's all So I'm so hot. <laughs> I'm sweating buckets. This is good. I love it. I love it. Baby. My so feels so happy. Is it? <laughs> yeah. I'm like, whoa. I love it. It's beautiful. Oh, wow. Got... I feel like good. I know. I'm sweating buckets. <laughs> I know. Friends and family, it is my honor to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Maslick. You may now kiss the bride.
high school but our friendship really blossomed in the Toronto days. Uh, we went to a sport game in the early 2010s and that's when we realized we knew nothing about sport. I think it was lacrosse. Uh, we also realized we were destined to be great friends and that night really sealed the deal for our next 10 years of friendship. And I met Ola during university when Julia would invite her to our apartments on the weekend and she would show up and immediately start reorganizing our closets. And I thought, who is this chick? <laughs> but as you get to know Ola, you realize there's a lot more to her than a highly organized, lifelong learner who's hauling around a color-coded day planner. Where do I begin with Andrew? He's not just my cousin, he's like a brother to me. I've known him my entire life, we've shared countless memories and so many firsts together. I've always looked up to Andrew. I remember begging my mom to buy me Blink-182 CDs not because I like their music, but because Andrew did. That's the kind of influence he's had on me. Fortunately, I was wise enough not to follow him into the emo phase. <laughs> with his studded belts, black nail polish, and long straightened side bangs. Um, Ola and Andrew, we greet you with a traditional wedding bread and ceremonial blessing. They're presented with bread to wish them a family life fruitful in love and prosperity. Honey to wish for a sweet life and that they stick together in happiness and sorrow. Wine to bring joy to their lives and salt to preserve their marriage and add flavor for the rest of their days. wishes to you all the best in your family life and all the best in your professional life and I hope that in the near future your family will expand and will <laughs> maybe, <tonight>. <laughs> maybe not tonight <laughs> But now! <laughs> Why? Because children have to be healthy. So when you have some alcohol, don't make children! <laughs> I wish you to have healthy and happy children and happy family. Congratulations to both of you. All the best to you in your new life. Uh, I would like to add a few things because you want to you know, cover the um, uh, issues from the soul and from the heart. And I'm as a financial of our family, we would like to uh, also have a short speech, which I prepared here. It's going to just take a couple of minutes, okay? And this is like... Uh... <laughs> So, so I, I prepare a little summary of, uh, of uh, our investments in Ola, so Andrew knows, and he's going to, and he's going to protect that and carry on further, right? I remember when Andrew was born, uh, there was a feeling that resonated in my heart. I hoped that he would go far beyond me. I hoped he would grow up to be better, smarter, stronger, taller, and more successful than me. Andrew, you've checked all those boxes, and although I hate to admit it, you're a better fisherman and you have a much better hairline. Andrew, your father and I love you with all of our hearts, and we always will. You've turned out to be an exceptional young man, and seeing you so happy with Ola fills our hearts with joy and makes this day perfect. You are an amazing couple and we wish you every happiness in your future together. In closing, I would like to repeat some words in Ukrainian that my grandfather said to me when I was married 40 years ago. I wish you all the best in your life, and I wish you all the best in your life, and I wish you all the best in your life, and I wish you all the best in your life, and I wish you all the best in your life, and I wish you all the best in your life, and I wish you all the best in your life, and I wish you all the best in your life, and I wish you
щоб були втіхою своїм родичам і достойним прикладом для інших. Щастя вам Боже в тому. Translated into English, that is, I wish you mutual love and good fortune and a happy married life so that your relatives may take pride in you and your accomplishments and may you always be a worthy example to others. May God bless you in that. I know you'll be an amazing dad. The one who will probably say, don't worry, I won't tell mom. I'm excited to go old and wrinkling with you and hold hands with you. Wake up every morning next to you is my favorite thing. And drink and finish that wine with you. <laughs> I love you so much. <laughs> it was so good. It's like we read it together. <laughs> oh, you got me. Oh, wow. You got me. That worked. <laughs> Wow. That worked. I love you, baby. I love you, baby. <laughs>